Hey, beautiful people. So this is now day seven of my water fast journey. Ooh, baby, long extended fast. Had some dry fasting in there. Got to about 40 hours. Started drinking again. The next day after that. So finished up the dry fast. And closed it out with another ice bath. And started drinking water again the next day after that. Day six. Yeah. Okay. So day six yesterday. Um, I felt really run down. Um, I had a little bit of snake juice. It's salt water. And about midday, I started feeling super run down. Just very unpleasant. Lack of, lack of energy. Um, a lot of... The, the acceleration, the get up and go that I usually have just wasn't there. I didn't have a lot of enthusiasm for life. And so I drank some more snake juice, made another tea. And uh, this consists of some potassium, baking soda, a little bit of salt, cayenne pepper. I put lemon juice in it because I, was, I wanted some flavor and energy. I, was, I went out to the tree in our backyard and got a lemon. Uh -huh. It tasted great. But I drank that. Energy returned almost immediately. I realized at that point I hadn't been eaten for six days and I was on my feet almost the whole day post a dry fast. So I, maybe I was just low on salts. Maybe I was making excuses. Maybe I was getting weak of mind. Maybe my body was just feeling run down, whatever. But the tea helped. And then I'm noticing today, day seven, things are great. Things are great. So if you're not tracking what I've been what I've been talking about, um, this is seven days of no food. Two of those days, almost 40 hours, um, between days four and five, I didn't ingest any water. It was a soft dry fast, though, in that I took ice baths at night. Okay? So then day six was the first wet day after that dry fast. I was kind of run down, not really feeling 100%. Very tempted by food. And now day seven, feeling oh, hundred, like just feeling like a champion. That's how I'll say it. I am full of energy. I am, I'm thinking more clearly than I ever have. I'm very calm. I feel, as I said that, I imagined a dozen different things. It's like, I feel like a cloud dragon waterfall. <laughs> So maybe I'm insane. Maybe maybe no food has driven Luke finally insane. But uh, I don't think that's what's happening. Um, just had a dentist, dentist appointment, and that went really well. Um, teeth are really healthy. Got a little goodie bag. You want to see? Oh, my God. I got a goodie bag. So I've got a toothbrush and some floss and a little travel thing of toothpaste. It's just like being a kid again. And um, talked to the wedding caterer, picked up some uh, whitening strips, actually the dentist recommended, and I've got a wedding coming up. I've never actually tried whitening strips. I mean, they're not terrible, but I wouldn't mind getting rid of a little bit of the uh, years of coffee stains I've got on there. I'm not worried though. I'll try it. There's like 14 treatments in this box. And if I don't like it or it doesn't do anything or it gives me super AIDS or something like whatever, then I'll just fast again. Cure the super AIDS. You know, just try some stuff. Try something new. That's a really different subject, though. I mean, going from experimenting with teeth whitening to uh, experimenting with fasting. I feel like those are completely different uh, uh, things for health on the spectrum of health because one seems a little unnatural but it's mostly just hydrogen peroxide getting rid of, of tea stains and the other feels really natural because this I could live like this every day the state of being in which I'm at now day seven I, I worked this morning Focus was off the charts. Got a lot of stuff done in the hour and a half before the dentist. Went to the dentist, had conversation. Have you ever talked to someone? And you, got other side of and you, you can stay completely articulate? I doubt it. 
I doubt it. I could not stay completely articulate. They had to strap me down and hit me over the head with a hammer so I'd stop talking. But uh, it just went well. And now I'm just going to go work for a while before the wife and I have a DEXA scan later today. You'll see results for that tomorrow. And I'm very excited about that. DEXA scan is fascinating to me. I've always played with those, you know, the handheld fat reading devices or they, they tell you your body fat percentage, you hold them up and they send an electrical current through your body and they give you kind of a ballpark where your body's at. I haven't used one of those in quite a while, but a DEXA scan seems to be a little more accurate. Obviously, there's there's going to be inaccuracies. There's, there's going to be uh, better methods to measure possibly, but this is something that's available. The wife really wanted to check it out. Here I go. Let's try it. Um, yeah, not really sure what to expect from what I've seen online. You just lay on a table scanner thing goes over you. Cool. <laughs> they tell you your lean body mass and your body fat, uh, percentage and bone density and whatnot. And that's useful to know. That's good. She was saying, uh, the wife, she was saying that it tells you muscle imbalances as well. So like, are my left deltoids smaller than my right from years of like grabbing a backpack or I don't know. So that if that's true, that would be very useful information to get. So I'm looking forward to those types of results. I parked in a new area today with the car because we're going to be using this car a little later today. And I'm a little nervous because... This neighborhood's different than the one I normally park in. I'm a creature of habit. I like things to be kind of familiar. Is that human? Or is that just because I'm a grandpa? We'll find out. So fill my goodie bag with this cute little bottle of water. And uh, head into the house. Go get some work done. Just wanted to update everyone. Anyone who's on their fasting journey. Um, day seven's easier than day six if you're exactly like me. So I honestly would think I just wasn't drinking enough snake juice. I didn't have enough electrolytes in my system. Afterwards, drinking some, and, and then today I just feel better. Hunger is completely gone, by the way. It's it's not an issue. I'm, I'm not slow or unable to get my work done or to focus on it. My stomach is easily dismissed. All temptations in the head. Um, Costco was kind of a challenge yesterday. <laughs> but uh, today I walked through a, a pharmacy and got these teeth whitening strips. And uh, there's candy bars, all kinds of temptation. Felt nothing. Zero temptation. So am I getting stronger here? Am I breaking addictions? Is my body just going... Peanut M&M's, that sounds... No, I want steak. Like, I, I don't know. Whatever it is, not feeling much craving for food today. So, I think that's all I got. Uh, <laughs> gonna go work on more editing. Oh my God, that's a video for another time. Thank you for your time. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you later. And if I may